recording y'all. I'm trying to get this lighting. It's not okay because I'm not I'm not supposed to have the light like come down on me like this. I don't know. But yeah. to the picture but this is the picture I'm trying to go off of this is um ragged royale so I'm not sure I tag her Instagram down below she's only like 16 17 it's wild but we're gonna try to recreate her look so let me redo my eyebrows and we'll get into the video there we go so I don't know if my lighting looks okay or not like I'm trying to do my best with it um, but yeah so I saw this look on Instagram and I was just like, I gotta try that out. Like, I'm trying to do better in makeup, whatever, and I don't know, like, you only gonna get better if you actually practice. So, we're gonna try to do this look today. So, yeah, um, I have a mirror here, so I'm gonna be looking into. So, yeah, so let me get the picture up. Um, so let's see, I'm gonna first put white all over my eyes. So, I have the milk um what's the color milk it's the nyx jumbo eye pencil people used to always use these in all the tutorials i guess now i died down but i'm gonna use this for my concealer i use this as a base because um i want all the colors to pop Now I'm gonna put powder on my eyes to set that. So I'm using this um, Makeup Forever powder and just going over my eye. So we're gonna start with the inner corner and go out and then do the rest. Okay. So in the middle, she has like a like a blue shade, or in the inner corner, she has like a blue shade and it goes to like a green. So and it's not like a lot. A blue I mean it's a good amount but like you know I'm still gonna use a little brush for this part no actually I'm gonna use an eyeshadow brush for this part from elf and the blue is like a lighter blue let me make sure this blue in here is not See, this is a little struggle y'all because she did a lot and I don't know if she used one palette or what but I don't have like one main colorful palette that's like huge with like every shade in here okay so I'm gonna use like this weird blue purple looking color on the inner corner, so. And if you're using multiple brushes, I really recommend you guys use one of these. It's like a sponge brush cleaner type of thing. And you use that to clean your brushes, like, so you can do long mix colors. Now she has that green shade, the two greens. So now I'm gonna use this shade out of the NYX, or yeah, out of the NYX Ultimate Palette. It's in bright. And we're gonna use that like right on top of it, but like still beside it. Then next she goes in with like a orange shade, I think. Or is it yellow? She goes into yellow and then orange. Okay. So she goes into yellow and then orange. So I do have like a yellow orange shade. So I'm going to do yellow, yellow, orange, and then orange. It's the same palette. I'm going too far over, obviously. So I'm just going to like put that right over top there. Even though... The yellow orange is not showing as much. Just, just, I'm trying to recreate it, y'all. It's not going to be like perfect or anything. Alright. So now I'm going to wipe my brush. So then she goes into like red, pink, and then purple. So I'm going to take a smaller brush. I have a red. So the red I'm using is in the Urban Decay um, Full Spectrum Palette. 
So I'm gonna put red, red on top of that area right there. And then I'm gonna go in with pink from the NYX palette. So we got it going on so far, y'all. So the pink, it's like a bright pink, so I'm gonna put a pink. Oh, she got it going on. She has now blue, well, purple and then blue. So I'm gonna wipe this off. I'm gonna go into the purple shade from the Ultimate palette. Put this like on the end. I guess kind of mix it up the pink. It's okay. I'm trying to recreate. It's not gonna be perfect. And then clean that off. And now she has blue on the outer corners. Yeah. Is that the same blue from earlier? It just might be. So now take that blue. And use that on the outer corners. I'm gonna mix that with like a different blue. I'm mixing the, the full spectrum blue. Um, by the way, it's in Metamorph. Metamorphic, I think. And then I'm gonna mix it in with this blue as well. This is a Makeup Shack T44 brush, and I'm gonna take the two blues from the Ultimate palette, and she brings it down like, like she has it up here, and then she brings it literally all the way down here. is like outside of that so I'm going to put all this stuff off y'all this lighting is not really doing this whole look justice but we're gonna have to work with it hold on I'm gonna try to see if I can get better lighting it's still not really that much better so now I'm gonna go in with the green and put that like on the edges of that Alright, and then she takes the purple shade. And I'm gonna use that little brush again. Make sure it's clean. Gonna take purple. And she has that her lower lash line right here. And then she has pink like kinda under it. She does orange, take a thinner one. And then of course next is yellow. And then, yeah, yellow is the last color. So we can go ahead and continue that here and then take the yellow orange color and blend the yellow and the orange together So now we look like this Y'all I messed up. This was a whole cut crease. So now we're gonna make this look perfect. Okay Wow, I really already like messed up. So now <laughs> oh, I didn't even realize that. Okay, so now I'm going to do The other colors that's in the crease Wow, y'all this would look so much better it did the, it was a, it's a whole quick crease. Okay, so now we're gonna do in the inner corner. She has purple, then pink, a little bit of purple, then pink. She's the same thing. So we're gonna go up here. Y'all, I'm mad. Like, that would've looked so much better if I kept it the way she has it. So it's purple and then pink. This is the moment when I realized this is gonna be a failed video. Purple and pink. 
and then orange. And then it connected the blue with, with the yellow, so you know, just just do what you can. Uh, this looks so bad. This was supposed to be literally a cut crease, and I still didn't do a cut crease. All right, so now I'm gonna go back to the picture because I got out of it. So now we gotta put yellow like above that pink. So we're gonna take this, take yellow, and yellow goes like up here. Yellow, green. And then she has, it goes into green, like eventually like up here. Yeah, this looks so bad. Let's get some more of that yellow. At this point, I'm just like mixing stuff. But it's gonna look okay. It looks like art, kinda, you know. And then I'm gonna do yellow. Like officially, like right up here, and then in a corner she has like a green, green color, bluish color. So I have this Make It Revolution palette. Palette can't speak. I'm gonna take this little brush and put that green shade on the inner corner of our eyes. This looks like not that bad, but like. The camera quality is not helping at all. All right, so then let's see what she got going on. She has a white eyeliner, so I'm gonna put that white liner or white pencil on my line liner, waterline. This looks so bad, like. Y'all, I'm so sorry that you waste your time watching this. What's the fun in it, you know? We're trying. So then, I'm gonna take mascara, this Maybelline, um, Lash Sensational. So I'm just gonna go in and do mascara. I don't think she wore eyeliner. No, she didn't. So, I'm just gonna do mascara. I mean, it's not that bad. Mm. Yeah, I'm really gonna hate myself when I edit this. But anyway, I'm gonna put on these lashes. These are the Salon Perfect Lashes and Go Glam Multi Pack. And I'm gonna use old pair because I'm not trying to mess up my new ones. So let me just take the glue off of these. Alright. So using Duo Lash Glue. I'm gonna start off with my. Which one is this? To make sure this is the right one. So let me put blue on it. I'm about to get tacky. I don't know. Okay, so now I'm going. This looks so bad. <laughs> Oh my god, as you guys can tell, I am not a makeup artist. I'm over here trying to be one. My lashes usually look way better than this. Okay, but now I'm going to just put mascara on my lower lash line. I'm gonna fill it in a little bit more because like, it looks kind of weird on so. So I'm gonna do my face makeup and then I'll show you guys the results after. All right, y'all. So in the video or in the picture, she's wearing blush. So I'm gonna take. Let's see what color. Hmm. I'm gonna take. She has like an orangey pink blush though. So I'm just gonna take this color right here and wear that as blush. I don't ever wear blush, so we're gonna put it on like this highlighter almost. Gonna mix in a little bit of pink, not too much. I mean, this has shimmer in it, so it's practically highlighter, but 
Yeah, I've never, I never wear blush. I'm about to look like a whole clown. So I'm gonna put on so bad, but I'm gonna finish the makeup on my phone. So right now I'm putting on the blush like I said before. And then this is so bad. Like my camera literally just died, and I don't have a a battery for it. So like I gotta work with whatever I got. But yeah, so I'm putting on the blush right now. And then I'm gonna put on the lip gloss too. I'm just gonna switch y'all right here. Y'all see my back up and background and everything, but at this point, I don't even care. So, the lip gloss I'm gonna wear is the Vivid Hot Lacquer, and it's from Maybelline. I'm just gonna. Just risk it all. Don't even wear. Um, don't even wear lip liner. You know, just risk it all. And then, over top of that, I'm gonna do highlighter. I'm using this White and Wild Mango Highlighting Powder. By the way, the blush I use was from the Glamorous, Glamorous Brush Blush BH Cosmetic Palette. So I'm just gonna highlight every area that needs highlight. Alright. So <laughs> I look, I look crazy. Okay, so I also tried a different product today for my baking powder, so that's why I look a little ashy everywhere and like. I just don't look good right now. But we're really focused on the eye look, y'all. Like, look at the difference. Oh, look at the difference. This, this video is so bad. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video. <laughs> it's so bad. But it's okay because we're, we're on the channel to have fun. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like. And don't forget to click that bell. Um, it's actually down there, but you know, the little edit pops here. But anyway, yeah. Um I'm gonna, take a, I'm gonna try to take a decent picture. Hopefully, I can take a good thumbnail because this looks so bad. But yeah, so thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.